Becoming a doctor, nurse or police officer are the top dreams for children, but with age, people become more pragmatic and less likely to follow their dreams. However, in tonight's successful Fijian, Kelevi Lamon followed his childhood goal despite numerous challenges to become a dive instructor. Pranita Prakash with his success story. Thirty-eight-year-old Kelevi Lam On, who grew up on the beautiful island of Benga, was inspired by the dive instructors and the suit. Yeah, when I was uh, really young, uh, it wasn't really easy for us. Um, with uh, our dad uh, working as a captain, who wasn't bringing enough uh, income. With uh, lots of brothers and sisters, there was about seven of us. Eh? Seven in our family, including my mom and dad, which was about nine. The father of three was determined that his upbringing wouldn't stop him from achieving his goal. I got on through my high school, uh, primary school and then high school and did a bit of work in Suva and then decided to move back to the island and pursue my career as a dive instructor. Lam On didn't have a wealthy family to fall back on or well-connected friends who could help him get this started, he knew he had to accomplish his dream on his own. Uh, it took me about uh, four years to get to where I am now today. Uh, it wasn't easy becoming an open water diver, working my way up to dive master. But then I found out to become a dive instructor, it cost about six grand. So then I had to do a lot of saving. So it took me another but only one year to save that money. And then I found out, I can, once I sit the test, if I fail the test, I'd have to pay another six grand to sit the test again. So I really, really put a lot of pressure on me. But in the end, I got through it. In order to save money to pursue his career, Lam On ventured into farming. To save uh, money, I started uh, farming, uh, planting, uh, I was, um, we had to, I had to ask for seeds from my uncle so we could plant. Uh, also, we had to cut down on our budget. I had to, I was working as a crew on the boats, so I wasn't getting enough pay. So I had to budget my money in order to save, to uh, pay for my tuition for the dive instructions. Lam On, who is now a dive instructor for the Benga Island Lagoon Resort, says, his hard work has definitely paid off. Depending on the guests at the resort, he provides diving tuition to four students in a week. He believes perseverance and patience are necessary to achieve success in life. And while the current pandemic has affected his work, he remains optimistic that the tourism industry will definitely bounce back. Pranita Prakash, FBC News.